Tempe isn't the only Valley City hoping to cash in on making changes to how people park. A survey in the city of Phoenix asked commuters what would work in making parking downtown a lot easier. Courtney Olis joins us from the first from First Street in downtown Phoenix with more on what commuters are looking for. Courtney. Have you ever found yourself checking your pockets, your purse, even those small compartments in your car to find some spare change to spare you that parking ticket? Well, those days may be coming to an end in this town. Finding a parking spot in downtown Phoenix can be a challenge, but it seems the real hassle comes when it's time to pay. You need coins and no one carries coins anymore. You had to rush back, put more money in the machine and then go way back on the other side. So that is inconvenience. It's also an inconvenience for downtown business owner Sabrina Drago, who's constantly dealing with people parking in her private lot. Well, as you can see, it's a, it's a pretty empty lot. And I think a lot of students, when they uh, drive by every day, they see that hardly anybody's parked here. So they take the opportunity and, and sneak in. And we have to tell them that unfortunately it's a private lot and they do Toe. And some residents simply bypass downtown altogether. I avoid downtown whenever possible. With the goal of drawing people to downtown, the city decided to post a survey online asking how it can better meet parking needs. Right now, the most common complaint is that they don't have enough coins for the meters. But what if you could manage all of those fees from a mobile device? You can open an account online. You can register any debit or credit card, and then you can manage those fees from your cell phone. Using the cell phones, we could update the meter, you know, our meter quickly. And then your cell phone can watch the clock for you. They have technology that can send you a message that tells you that your time is running out. And in a high-tech, high-paced world, it seems that parking peace of mind is priceless. Now that parking survey does close tomorrow and the results do need to be analyzed. Although many of our viewers at home may be saying they want those changes, the city says it's a very long process. You're going to have to be patient before you see some changes made on these streets. I'm live in downtown Phoenix, Courtney Olish, Cronkite News.